We've just been treated to an extraordinary clash in boxing history, witnessing David Benavidez engage in a fierce battle against the formidable Demetrius Andrade. It was a night that truly showcased the essence of boxing. Benavidez's remarkable performance stunned everyone, myself included. Few anticipated the Mexican powerhouse to step into the ring and deliver such a knockout blow to Andrade. This showcased a significant leap in Benavidez's skill set, marking a notable improvement that has the entire boxing world clamoring for a Benavidez versus Alvarez showdown. The buzz around this potential fight is electric, with Benavidez emerging from a monumental victory that places him right at the pinnacle alongside the reigning king, Canelo Alvarez. However, as the saying goes, there can only be one king. Despite the hype surrounding a potential clash between Benavidez and Alvarez, it seems Alvarez has unequivocally shut down any prospects of this high-stakes fight. For those seeking answers as to why this bout hasn't materialized, you've come to the right place. David Benavidez sent shockwaves across the internet with his dominating victory over Demetrius Andrade, a result that caught everyone off guard. Andrade, known as Boo Boo, carried an undefeated record, making him a formidable opponent. Yet, when pitted against the Mexican powerhouse, the expectations of a closely contested matchup were widespread. Even Canelo Alvarez himself considered this fight a 50-50 proposition, acknowledging the anticipated intensity between two unbeaten fighters. There were predictions of a strategic chess match, possibly going the distance without knockouts. However, reality had a different plan. Contrary to the expectations of a closely fought battle, the actual outcome was far from it. We witnessed a one-sided, brutal beatdown that was nothing short of ruthless. Before the fight, Canelo Alvarez confidently expressed his willingness to take on the victor, even hinting at a potential desire to step into the ring with the eventual winner. That attitude showcased a genuine eagerness for a formidable challenge. However, following Benavidez's masterful display, Canelo's stance underwent a drastic shift. His responses were met with a repetitive refrain whenever questioned about a prospective matchup against Benavidez, a sudden shift to radio silence. Despite the glaring sense that this fight between Benavidez and Alvarez was the logical next step in the boxing landscape, Canelo's avoidance became increasingly apparent. This match embodied the clash of Mexican titans, with both fighters holding significant sway in the realm of boxing. It was a matchup where picking a clear winner was a daunting task. Benavidez's recent performances showcased his scorching form, while Canelo's legendary status in the sport remains unquestionable. Alvarez's reluctance to engage with the Mexican monster Benavidez became more evident, signaling a conscious evasion of what could have been the most fitting and anticipated showdown in the boxing world. At this juncture, it's understandable I wouldn't fault Canelo for hesitating considering the sheer power Benavidez brings to the ring. If I were in Canelo's shoes, I'd definitely pause before even mentioning Benavidez's name. But hold on to your seats because there's more to this story. Just when you thought things couldn't get more intriguing, Canelo Alvarez finally addressed the anticipated showdown with Benavidez and what he said might dampen some spirits. Canelo acknowledged the widespread desire for a fight against Benavidez, emphasizing that while he recognizes the public's interest, his decisions are based on his own aspirations. He highlighted that his sights are set on bigger and more significant opportunities lying ahead. According to Canelo, Benavidez simply doesn't pose a hindrance in his path. While expressing respect for Benavidez as a fellow Mexican fighter, Canelo asserted that Benavidez has yet to reach his level. He concluded that there's no rationale for him to consider this fight, dismissing it from his future plans. This sudden turn of events surely adds an interesting twist. It's a statement that could potentially challenge perceptions. While it might be unexpected to view Canelo Alvarez as avoiding a challenge, his stance indicates a belief that Benavidez doesn't pose a genuine threat to his position in the sport. However, it's leaving many wondering if this stance might be an evasion of what could be a formidable challenge from Benavidez, whom Canelo might regard as a serious threat to his dominance in the ring. Alvarez might believe his clever words can deceive us, but it's evident he's avoiding the fight. If he assumes fans won't see through his tactics, he's sorely mistaken. Just take a glance at the uproar on Twitter, fans aren't buying into his sudden change of heart. 
One fan expressed disappointment, stating that as a loyal supporter of Canelo, this avoidance is unexpected and disheartening. The sentiment echoes many voices questioning why Canelo is shying away from the Benavidez challenge, especially considering his previous discussions about a potential showdown. It's a valid observation. Canelo seemed open to this fight before, but now he's backpedaling. It's almost insulting how he assumes the fans won't notice. Benavidez isn't one to let Alvarez off the hook so easily. The sentiment among fans indicates a collective disbelief at Canelo's abrupt reluctance to engage in a fight he previously seemed open to, leaving many questioning his motives. Don't expect the Mexican monster to stay silent while Canelo shuts down this fight. Benavidez has hit back, and he's come out swinging, no holds barred. He's labeled Canelo Alvarez a duck, making his stance crystal clear. Benavidez firmly believes Canelo is scared, especially after witnessing what he did to Boo Boo. He's convinced that Canelo anticipates a similar fate if they were to face off in the ring. Benavidez is adamant that Canelo is evading him and asserts he won't allow him to find peace until he steps up to the challenge. The message is loud and clear. You can't run forever, Alvarez. This fiery response from Benavidez is enough to send shivers down your spine. David Benavidez is absolutely driven. He's craving the toughest challenge in the ring, and for him that fight is undoubtedly against Canelo. However, there's a crucial factor to consider. Canelo Alvarez holds the reins in boxing. He's the face of the sport and holds all the decision-making power. If Alvarez declines, it's a solid no, and that's a reality one can't dispute, even if it's apparent that he's avoiding Benavidez. Benavidez stands as a genuine threat in the boxing world, even earning praise from the legendary Mike Tyson himself. Tyson, a revered figure in the sport, acknowledged Benavidez as someone he'd fear if he were in the same division, emphasizing that no one seems capable of challenging Benavidez, a statement grounded in undeniable facts. It's worth noting that it was Iron Mike who bestowed upon Benavidez the moniker The Mexican Monster, a title that accurately depicts Benavidez's current dominance wreaking havoc in the boxing scene. Benavidez's reputation as a force to be reckoned with has created a situation where few are willing to step into the ring with him. However, there's still one individual who remains undeterred and willing to face Benavidez head-on, a figure well known to all. The renowned boxing sensation Terence Crawford, known as Bud, is eager to step into the ring with Benavidez. Witnessing Benavidez's performance against Boo Boo has ignited a desire in Bud for this particular fight. One thing that's undeniable about Terence Crawford is his unwavering resolve in the face of a challenge. Rest assured, Bud won't approach this fight lightly. He understands that it's bound to be the toughest test in his career thus far. Bud's admiration for the Mexican monster is evident from his remarks. He praised Benavidez's performance, describing it as spectacular and highlighting him as one of the premier offensive fighters in the game. Acknowledging Benavidez's relentless pressure, intelligent jabbing, and precise punching, Bud pointed out a need for tighter defense. However, overall, he believes Benavidez is a formidable opponent. Bud expressed his willingness to face Benavidez, stating that he sees their potential fight as one that would be competitive and engaging. He affirmed that he'd readily accept the opportunity to step into the ring with Benavidez at any time. This unexpected turn of events adds a new layer of excitement to the boxing landscape. Bud might be in the mix, but I don't foresee that matchup materializing either. Benavidez has his eyes firmly fixed on Canelo. That's the fight he's gunning for. And in all honesty, Benavidez has rightfully earned a shot at it. When you consider the boxing landscape, who else truly poses a challenge to Canelo? Many believed Jermal Charlo might be that adversary, but Canelo's domination over Charlo in their ring encounter revealed otherwise, leaving Benavidez as the standout option. However, it appears Canelo has set his sights on different opponents, leaving us wondering if not Benavidez, then who? Who is the fighter that Canelo is prioritizing for his next bout? Prepare to be amazed because here's the bombshell. Canelo is eyeing a rematch with Floyd Mayweather. Yes, you heard it correctly. Mayweather is contemplating a return from retirement to re-enter the boxing scene, shifting his focus from fighting YouTubers to professional boxers. 
In a recent interview, Canelo expressed interest in a rematch with Mayweather, stating that despite their extensive history, there's unresolved tension between them. Alvarez admitted feeling like he didn't make a significant impact in their initial bout, but hinted that a rematch would showcase an entirely different narrative. One where Mayweather might find himself on the receiving end of a knockout for the first time in his career. It seems that Canelo has absolutely no interest in facing Benavidez in the ring. Instead, his focus is on a potential match against Floyd Mayweather. When Benavidez caught wind of this, he couldn't help but chuckle. He remarked, I'm currently among the best fighters globally. Floyd is aged and retired. It's hard to argue with that perspective. Nobody truly wants to witness Canelo facing off against a 50-year-old retired fighter. We crave excitement, intensity, and a genuine showdown. For those seeking a historic battle, the hope remains that Canelo will agree to fight Benavidez, as that's the dream matchup. In the end, let the finest Mexican fighter prevail. As always, only time will reveal how this unfolds in the fight world. So that's all from today's video. If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell icon so you never miss our upcoming videos. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section. Stay tuned and we will catch you in the next video.